The Fed minutes highlight Wednesday's calendar and will be taken in later in the day. As much as the market loves to clamor around Fed event risk, we're not so sure there will be much to scream about when it comes to today's release. First off, remember, these are the minutes from what was already an uneventful central bank meeting after the Fed had come out with a batch of unscheduled meetings in response to the coronavirus fallout in which it did everything and then some. The Fed slashed rates at 1.5% over that period, committed to unlimited QE, enhanced central bank swap lines, and restarted a $2 trillion dollar domestic loan program. So we're talking about the market taking in the minutes of a meeting that had come after a bunch of surprises, leaving no room for any additional surprise. The second reason we see no real volatility around the event is similar to the first. Over the past few days, we've heard from Fed Chair Powell not once, but twice as far as his outlook for monetary policy in the U.S. economy goes. And that's about as fresh of an update as one can ask for. There has been a lot of talk about negative interest rate policy in recent weeks, which could be a conversation that that comes up in the minutes. But again, the Fed chair has made it very clear that the Fed is not convinced negative rate policy is effective, and it would much rather use many other tools at its disposal to combat additional stress to the system. And so all in all, we'd say that as far as Fed event risk goes, this should be as uneventful as one could expect with this type of a release. Let's see what happens. That's all for now.